I'ma just jump right into it. I'm gonna try out the wet look. I got my bottle, so I'm just kinda wet the back real good. And then I got Curl Essence Moisturizing Curl Activator right here. Jamaican, Jamaican Black Castor Oil and Coconut Oil. <laughs> Just take some of that. Ooh. Wiggly. About that much. Run it through the small section that's in the back of my head. Boom. Dude, I think I'm gonna need some shea butter. Yeah, I think I'll go need some shea butter because I know my hair is not going to lie down. <laughs> oh wow, we have a pig that's in the house. <laughs> <laughs> you said, <laughs> you said, you're <laughs> Okay, yeah, whatever. <laughs> and then I'm gonna put some of the Aussie Moist conditioner in there. Probably like, why are you putting conditioner in your hair? Because I can. Leave me alone. It's my hair. Jesus Christ. Dude, I don't have to cut my ends anymore. You know what I mean? Mm. They not bad. But I don't know why they so dry. I don't know, y'all wanna get a, you know, a nice little look at them. That is. Oh my gosh, I thought BB was right there. Somebody like try to sniff at me. I'm just editing this out. Bye. Bye. I have a Vaseline container. My shea butter container always busts, so. I have shea butter in here. And, oh my gosh. She's so thick, baby. I'm gonna split it like so. Put it in my hand. And now I'm gonna just kinda heat it up. Cause I notice when I heat it up, it does better. Looks like this. One hand per side. And then just kinda get it all up in there. I have a mirror right there. I have to pretty much heat it up, work it through. I'm gonna try this out because I think I get it dry by tonight. And then I have work tomorrow. So I think this would be pretty good. Cute slick back hair. I'm making some of the weirdest faces, but whatever. You guys want to kind of get a look at like my curls. Hopefully y'all can see kind of what they is. I have high porosity hair. My hair grows fairly fast. Like, dude, I'll show you guys. Oh, hair. Go away, shed hair. Thank you. Start at the base, work it all the way down to the ends. Then based on how the ends are looking, I could kind of tell whether it needs something to weigh it down a little bit more. So now I just directly applied the shea butter on the ends. Oh, yeah, I can see that. Getting that good old stuff in there. 
now this is what both sides are looking like. Wet line extreme. Because wet line extreme is bunny. And then as my freezing spray, I'm gonna use got to be glued. I probably like, oh my gosh, don't do that. I'm gonna do it anyway. So now just to make sure everything is still wet, aka wet look, not moist, dripping. Oh yeah, don't need to monetize already before your monetization career already even started. Now, through some parts of my hair, it isn't uniformly colored, but that's personally how I like for my hair to be. Like you even just see it in this. Kind of see like some orangey blonde, some very vibrant pink. <clears throat> and also like a softer layered pink that looks a bit dingy. I don't know, that's kind of like how I like it. And I don't dye my hair one color. I dye it like two. So, it's kind of my hair. Um, what else? I've almost been natural for four years. Two and a half of those years were like just me focusing on getting to know my hair. And obviously my hair wasn't bleached. I like bleached my hair but for the first time almost a year ago. Yeah, almost a year. Because I think I bleached it June 23rd. And obviously when this video goes up, it's going to be going up before the 23rd. And at this point, I'm just really focusing on flattening out the base of my hair. Just really paint it flat, add a little bit of water. At this point, I'm just moving it further down. And then I'm gonna pretty much take some of this spray and just spray. Ooh. Make sure we get it go. Dude, what? Boom! Another freeze dry spray is on that root and it ain't going nowhere. And then in the end, I'll just spritz the length of my hair. I've done one section. Obviously, can't really show you guys the back, so I'll come back when I'm at the top of my head. Cool. <sighs> we still got light. Okay, I'm just finish up this side with y'all.
my stand just full of stuff back there but this is what it's looking like right now i'm gonna wait for it to somewhat dry closer to the root and then i'm gonna go in with the lot of body hair mousse just to put throughout the length of my hair and i'll show y'all the final result i pulled it back into a little ponytail to stretch it overnight and i'll be finishing up the drying process with a blow dryer but other than that here are my curls